Hi, third graders, this is Mr. VD. So we had a YouTube lesson on predicting weather. So today we're gonna to be going outside and we're gonna have a predicting weather lesson where I'm not telling you what month or day we're in, but just by looking at what you see outside, we're gonna be looking at the clouds. And we had another YouTube video on all the different clouds there are, and we're gonna predict what kind of weather there is. Um, you, looking at the trees and looking at the grass, we're gonna figure out what time of the year it is. And then looking at the clothes I'm wearing and things you hear in the video, birds, or if you hear kids playing, what kind of weather and time of the year do you think it is? So let's head outside. Welcome back. So as you can see, I just put a sweatshirt on. So that could give you a little bit of a hint of maybe what time of the year it is and what kind of weather we have outside. But the first thing I want you to take a look at here is the trees. And you can see if we span across here that they are moving. And I see some leaves falling down. And hopefully you could hear in the video that rustling sound of the leaves. <laughs> Bring it down here. And we have some leaves here that have fallen and the sounds that they make. Also, while we're looking down here, take a look at the grass, the color of the grass. You can see it's not so green anymore and it's turning yellow. And we're gonna move the camera up and we're going to try to take a look at these big, white, puffy clouds. And we have another YouTube lesson that talks exactly about the name of these clouds, which should tell you what kind of weather we're having or we will have shortly. So taking all of these clues in, and actually, I don't see any birds out here. There's no, the birds are high in the sky. They're not flying low to the ground, which was another part of our lesson. There's no sun in the sky that could help tell you what temperature we have. So I want you to think about what time of the year do you think it is? What month? Uh, what degree temperature do you think it is? And what kind of weather do you think we will have? Do you think it'll stay like this all day? Or, or because of these clouds, do you think we'll have different weather shortly? So besides looking outside, one other thing you could do is take a look at what's around you at the school. You can take a look at all the projects we have and that should be a huge hint of what time of the year it is and what season it is. And once you know the season, you could probably narrow down the weather a little bit easier. So I hope you enjoyed this lesson and uh, make sure you follow up with uh, in class with your thoughts on it.